Hey everybody, this is do-it-yourself traffic stop number three. This is going to be a real short one. I just come across something that I think that you'll be interested in. Um, copies of these documents can be private. My found at my private group at Yahoo called Administrating Your Public Servants. For a complete set of YouTube videos with private information shares, a DVD with over 50 searchable law dictionaries and other videos or books and forums, please contact me privately at engineerwin at yahoo.com. Um, and this last paragraph is for all the Satanist order follower revenue officers operating in their private capacity under the Federal Tax Lien Act of 1966. Donations to support this work are appreciated. However, uh, I prefer gold or silver coin. But as an extremely less desirable alternative, I can accept the IOUs, the Federal Reserve notes, the PayPal gifts, the checks, the money orders. Send me an email for particulars. Um... Cubeyard.com. For great custom websites, domain names, and hosting, go to Cubeyard.com. Um, uh, use coupon code CY172 for 20% off your first order. Cubeyard.com, your source for websites, domain names, and hosting. Um, so, uh, what we're going to talk about today is uh, there was one of my uh, uh, people on my group that was telling me uh, privately about this. He was at a... Um, a meeting in Albuquerque, New Mexico, and one of the people at the meeting went out and deliberately went too fast. We're talking about a form that they had at this meeting that uh, you have and you present it to the police. Anyways, one of the people at the meeting went out, deliberately went too fast on the freeway and got stopped and presented this form to the police officer. The officer took the form and still gave him a ticket, but the next day they went to the police department and asked for the completed form. And after looking into it, the police told him that they had no record of that ticket. <laughs> so, you know, if, if, however you can deal with it, uh, uh, that's the important thing. Uh, the, the case disappears. Everybody's happy, you know. Anyway, so we're going to talk about this form. This is the form right here. Um, this is uh, getting in a little closer. Um, it's called Notice of Inquiry and or Report of Detainment. Uh, this is actually... Um, my form that I made up based on the other form, okay? Um, so um, it's not exactly the same as the other form. It is slightly different, but uh, this is one that I made up based on the other form. Um, and it's, and so anyways, uh, you put down the, you, you uh, when they stop you, you ask them to fill it out. And, um, and since they want your information, you want theirs. And uh, so uh, you notice the blocks, public servant, badge number, jurisdiction, Peace officer, yes or no? Okay, you're asking them. They're you're basically giving you evidence against themselves, big time, on your oath today. Okay, <laughs> that's that's implying that sometimes they're not uh, they're in their private capacity, and of course, in this case, they are. Location of stop, uh, which is an arrest. Okay, um, uh, do you believe that this stop is related to a, mo a driver or motor vehicle operating in commercial commerce? And, uh, and yes or no, okay? And list any passengers, good or merchandise attached to or inside the said motor vehicle, okay? And so, again, where's your evidence, okay? Why do you think that I'm involved in commerce, okay? This, like, kills them, big time kills them. And, uh, and then it's got information to put down your information for them. They put it down. Uh, a license plate, no plate, yes or no. Okay, and uh, and victims. Okay, we're going to go into it more. There's more, but we're going to go into that in a minute. Anyways, so the important thing is that uh, it ish hits on the issue of oaths, and all oaths must be lawful, allowed by common law or some statute if they're administered by persons in a private capacity or not duly authorized. They are quorum non judice and void, uh, and those administering them are guilty of high contempt for doing it without a warrant of law and punishable by fine or imprisonment. Now, this is taken from Tomlin's Law Dictionary, 1835 edition, but this, they're citing Book 3 and Book 4 of Coke's Institutes on the Laws of England. So this is as old as time itself. Now, whether it's uh, actually they, they are guilty of high contempt, which it would be a type of a contempt here. Uh, um, um, and so uh, it wouldn't be called high contempt, obviously, but it would still be contempt. Um, contempt of court, contempt of, uh, of uh, yeah, contempt. Uh, anyways, because uh, because so they're operating in their private capacity, they're guilty of contempt, uh, and so uh, anyways, um, and then so that covers the oath, 
and and so then uh, it talks again about the uh, uh, location. Uh, the uh, do you believe that uh, this is related to a, a motor vehicle operating in commercial commerce? And and list all of the uh, all of the stuff. And the why that's powerful is, whoops, I must have gone the wrong way. Anyways, um, their 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 procedures they're in their private. I must have gone the wrong way. Yep. Uh, anyways, the words penal and penalty, because that's what they're doing is they're trying to hit you with a penalty. Okay, they're giving you a ticket. That's a penalty. Speeding fine is a penalty. Um, in their strict and primary sense, denote a punishment, whether corporal or pecuniary, imposed and enforced by the state for a crime or offense against its laws. The noun penalty is defined forfeiture to be forfeited for non-compliance with an agreement. The words forfeit and penalty are substantially synonymous. Uh, a penal action is a civil suit brought for the recovery of a statutory forfeiture when inflicted as punishment for an offense against the public. Such actions are civil actions on the one hand closely related to criminal prosecutions and on the other hand to actions for private injuries. Okay, so if it's a private injury, he's operating in his private capacity. Okay, that's the point I want to make uh, in which the party agreed made by statute recover punitive damages. So where's the contract? Okay, again, there's two cases that talk about private, uh, um, and, and this is the oath. So what's going on here? There we go. I'm hitting these wrong buttons or something. Anyways, under Texas law, no act or omission is a crime unless made so by statute. The legislature may create an offense and in the state enactment provide an exception. And so again, it comes down to uh, uh, offenses and being penal, and it's all for a breach of contract. Um, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Don't forget to like this video. Don't forget to click the bell next to the subscribe button so that you're notified when there's a new upload. Um, there's the front page of my channel. There's an arrow pointing to the bell. Click on the bell. A pop-up will come up and you'll have to check a box and click OK uh, so that you're notified about new uploads. My contact information, my blog is SovereigntyInternational.wordpress.com. My website is SovereigntyInternational.fyi. My email is EngineerWin at Yahoo.com. My YouTube profile is Sovereign Living and Sovereignty International. My Facebook community page, I deleted it due to censorship on the part of Facebook. And my private group at Facebook called Sovereignty International is being deleted. It takes time to ban 17,000 people off your group. Um, and I'm not going to let Facebook profit from my hard work because that's exactly what they're doing. Um, the Yahoo private group is called Administering Your Public Servants. My Google private group is called Administering Your Public Servants. And follow me on Twitter. Uh, anyway, so let's get back to this. Um, another thing that it comes to mind is the, uh, we're talking about, um, the, uh, uh, carrying passengers or property for hire. And this is title 18 United States code section 31, a motor vehicle means every description or carriage, uh, or other contrivance propelled or drawn by mechanical power and used for commercial purposes on the highways and the transportation of passengers, passengers or property or property or cargo. The term used for commercial purposes means the carriage of persons or property for any fair fee, rate, charge, or other consideration or directly and, or indirectly in connection with any business or other undertaking intended for profit. So the point being is that they can regulate carrying passengers or property for hire, but otherwise they got nothing to say to you and they're in their private capacity. And the under the international law rule adopted for areas of federal legislative jurisdiction federalizes state civil law, including common law. The term serves to federalize not only the statutory, but the common law of a state jurisdiction. And this is taken from jurisdiction over federal areas within the states. Report for the Interdepartmental Committee for the Study of Jurisdiction over Federal Areas within the States. Part 2, a text of law of legislative jurisdiction submitted to the Attorney General and transmitted to the President June 1957. That's page 158. And on page 165 of the same document, it says, State and federal venue discussed. The civil laws effective in an area of exclusive federal jurisdiction are federal law. Okay, well, and I don't have it here, but there's uh, Supreme Court cases. There's lots of them that say that for U.S. citizens, um, they uh, the boundaries of the District of Columbia expand as necessary to all throughout the states. Um uh, so that uh, anywhere in any state is federal jurisdiction if you're a U.S. citizen. Anyways, um, 
The civil laws effective in an area of exclusive federal jurisdiction are federal law, notwithstanding their derivation from state laws, and a cause arising under such laws may be brought in or removed to federal district court. Okay, so the point being is that um, all the state laws are actually federal. Okay, that's the point. Now, uh, and this is the Federal Tax Lien Act of 1966 and the definitions. This is located at... Um, uh, uh, um, 80 stat, 1130 and 1131. Uh, motor vehicle means a self-propelled vehicle, which is registered. So this gives them the right to presume for use under laws of any state or foreign country. Security, so now they're talking about negotiable instruments. And so that's why they always want negotiable instruments, right? It's all under the Federal Tax Lien Act. Announcing a subscription-based YouTube channel called Sovereignty International. The recommended cost of the subscription is currently $1.99 because it avoids the advertising only. Uh, if you like my work, it can be a donation. It's a modest donation, but everything's appreciated. And a whole bunch of people chipping in a little bit. It adds up pretty fast. And so the only power that the New World Order Satanists have over us is through fraud and deception. And my agenda is to expose it for all our benefit. For that reason, there is very little exclusive material on the channel. There is exclusive material. I've been putting more and more. But um, but compared to the regular channel, uh, um, um, you know, um, there's all of the stuff that's on the regular channels on this channel. But the, but there's a lot of stuff uh, that's exclusive as well. I'm currently publishing three videos a week um, on the exclusive channel, two videos a week on the uh, free channel. And some people have had trouble finding the channel, so there's a link at the bottom, and you can type that in to you pause the video, type that into your uh, web browser and um, and pull it up um, some of the exclusive content is in Arlington private information share there's a couple of videos on land deed training on helping where I'm helping someone bring forward their land patent there's um, estoppel certificates training there's foreclosure estoppel certificates training there's toll road notice and demand training there's uh, notice of void judgment training there's revocation of signature training there's invoice training and there's administrative procedure training that's going to be, I'm in the process of making that right now. Um, there's going to be lawsuit training, criminal complaint training, third-party witness training, and other training. Um, and so uh, I'm open to requests. Uh, I've been kind of running out of ideas on things to do, and so uh, I've been making less videos because of it. Um, I don't want to repeat, you know, too much. Once I publish a video and I'm happy with it, then, then that's it. Um, anyways... Um, and this is the channel and the top arrow is pointing to the link again so you can type that one in and um, and it'll come up to it it'll come up in your in YouTube um, YouTube will, won't let me have a um, customized um, YouTube URL until I have at least a thousand subscribers and so um, I don't have that many and so this is the way I got to do it um, and also somebody sent me a dollar ninety nine donation uh, I actually didn't know if it was a donation or if it was a, um, they wanted me to subscribe to the channel. So I sent them an email and offered to refund it if that's what they wanted me to do. They never did respond. But so the point I want to make here is, is that I have absolutely no control over subscribers. I can't even see all of them. Uh, if you want to subscribe, you're going to have to click on the start free trial button. YouTube is probably going to want some payment information. I don't know what they're going to want, uh, but, uh, but you know, that's the way it's going to have to work. And uh, so, uh, and again, if you want to make a donation of $1.99 a month, it's certainly appreciated, uh, and uh, every little bit helps. Um, now, um, and now check out my other videos. I've got a Bankster Thieves playlist. I've got a Roman Cult playlist. Uh, the Bankrupt Corporate So-Called Governments video, Bar Members 1 through 3. I've actually got a Bar Members playlist. Uh, oh, that's actually at the bottom. Uh, do it yourself, how not to volunteer for a selected service in the draft. Martial laws here. Do it yourself, no income tax. Do it yourself, free mail. Do it yourself, kangaroo courts, one through five. The Canada Border Pigs playlist. Um, and then uh, the bar members and their satanic connections playlist. Um, and so now we're back to this. This is the bottom part of the forum. And, um, and so we were talking about victims before. And so, uh, again, that gives them an opportunity to go through and fill out, uh, you know, information. Property damage, yes or no. Estimated loss, physical harm, yes or no. Um, and then the statement here is really good. I really like it. As I, as the above named, above states, bonded officer, state that 
all information is given under oath and is true, correct, as stated above, under penalty of perjury. And then they print their name, they sign it, they date it, <clears throat> and then the notice is, is, is especially good. Um, in the event that you elect not to fill this form, you will accept or, or give your unconditional consent to a levy of your public bonds of, not, of no more than $100,000 per five minutes that I am detained by you and all other present officers. Notice to agent is notice to principal. Notice to principal is notice to agent. Public servant officer refusal. Yes or no? Circle one, please. <laughs> Anyways, uh, I really like it. Uh, so uh, this is going to be this document's entitled Notice of Inquiry and or Report of Detainment. I am I am printing some of these off. These are great. And I'm going to be in, it's going to be in my Yahoo group in the files directory for anybody else that wants to download it and print it off. Um, that doesn't want to be uh, confrontational like I can be sometimes. Um, and so um, uh, this is a nice way of approaching it and uh, certainly more conducive for a lot of people that... Um, um, want to have a nice way to approach it so uh, anyways and so that's about it that's this is just a short one i appreciate you taking time to watch it i hope this helps you uh, that's what my focus is is uh, to be the 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 best place to uh to uh, uh assert yourself and and uh, become truly free um the best source for all of that and so anyways thanks for watching and have a great day